question number 15 you are given a code od to the back you need to expose it to the world by creating a service od to web app svc on the port 30000 key the method used is nodes of the given cluster that means you need to expose it through node port node port is an open port that allows you to connect to that service using the node that particular port runs on each node so that is node port and you need to uh, there is a note given and it says the web application listens on port 80 let us just create the web app application first and then we will expose it and at the moment i don't have it right now in the environment so i'm going to create it first the steps will be in the description so if you want to do it in a command so i am going to expose the port 8080 for the container at the moment and then we will create this node port service on port 3000 so let's just go ahead ls g qc g run and as i say my app is audit web audit web app and then image is ngns and it's it's in a, it's a web application Port is 88. That's what uh, you will get it well in advance. We are creating this scenario here. So, audit web app is created. Now, what we will do is we will create a service. That we will first create a YAML and then we will edit it for certain information so that it will start listening on our port. So that's that's the way how you create it. So G. And then expose. Expose is a command that lets you create the service. So here I'm saying expose code. Uh, My code is audit web app. And I'm going to specify the name of the service that is audit web app SVC. Type is not port. Just need to make sure that n used here in node is capital, and the port in the port p used also would be capital. This is the way you specify types. But inside the file, if you are specifying something as as a parameter, there you will specify. other than type whatever information that we specify target port and node port their n would be small that is one catch that you need to make sure you don't do that as a mistake so hyphen hyphen try run and then try and hyphen o yeah let's see the end so as you can see the node port type here would be different than the node port defined here here whatever you say uh, uh, i'm going to edit this and you will see what i'm going to edit so let's just take this file inside one uh file and then let's just edit that file all right and i'm going to delete unnecessary information this is not needed status is not needed also time stamp is not needed only thing that i need to specify here is node port colon and then i will say 30000 q this is as per the question let's just create it and as you can see i have specified this file in this file uh, here whatever i have specified it is in small f so make sure that you are not doing this mistake 
and now let's just say we create hyphen app or you can say apply or it's, it's the same thing apply and audit so the service has been created now let's see if it is mapped correctly or not see get codes hyphen o and then write then let's just say grab audit it is just to skip some mistakes and I, I like this way so you can see the IP assigned to this code is this and I want to see this as an endpoint in my service also so G describe SVC and service name is audit web at SVC and let's just describe that if you see here the endpoint which is going to be the final termination point for this service whoever calls this app from outside it is going to be this and you can see it is endpoint whereas the node port which is the port of each node in the cluster would be 30,002 this is my um, you can say information that that lets me connect to specific service so we have already achieved this and this is it thank you for watching have a great time